Welcome to the Dreger Acuro pump and tube instructional video. I'm Ed Ligas, the U.S. Product Manager for Dreger Tubes. I'm going to show you how to use the Acuro pump and Dreger tubes. Prior to using any of the equipment, please read the instruction manual for the Acuro pump, as well as the instructions inside each package of Dreger tubes. Check the back of the package to make sure the tubes are within their shelf life. Today I'm using the water vapor 1B tube. Before we do anything, we'll need to conduct a leak test on the Acuro. Insert an unopened Draeger tube securely into the inlet and completely compress the bellows. The end of stroke indicator will turn from white to black. The pump is adequately leak proof if the end of stroke indicator has not turned white within 15 minutes. If the pump leaks, try inserting the tube into the socket more tightly and repeat the test. Otherwise, refer to the maintenance section of the instructions for use. Remove the tube and push the reset button to set the stroke counter back to zero. Take a tube from the package and using the tube opener 7000 included with each pump, remove both tips of the Draeger tube, twist to score the glass, then snap off the tip. The pump itself also has a cutter and tip breaker. Insert the tube into the pump inlet with the arrow pointing toward the pump. Grip the pump and compress the bellows completely. The stroke counter will advance. Release the bellows and air will be pulled through the tube. The stroke indicator turns black when you compress the bellows and pops up white when the pump stroke is complete. Don't start a new stroke until the indicator is white, showing the completion of one pump stroke. Take the required number of strokes according to the instruction sheet in the package this tube has a high range scale based on n equal 1 stroke and a low range based on n equal 2 strokes. This means that if the discoloration reaches the high range with one stroke, read the tube, but if not, take one additional stroke and read the low range scale. The discoloration did not reach the high range scale, therefore we need one additional stroke. Remove the tube and read the discoloration immediately. You can see this reading is about 5.5 milligrams per liter. Using an indelible marker, mark the end of the violet discoloration. The discoloration on a tube may change over time. Compress the pump four to five times after each test to flush the pump. If you have any questions, please contact the Draeger Technical Support Team. Thank you.